We're here at Ripley's Aquarium at Broadway at the Beach for an exclusive behind the scenes look at places you've never been. I don't even care how many times you've been here. You've not seen what I'm about to show you. Come on, let's check it out. This right that. here is a cow nose stingray. Oh, wow. Look Isn't it soft and gooey? They're like portobello mushrooms. In this tank, uh, what we're feeding them now, if you want to hold some squid. Sure. But don't squeeze the eyeball because it'll splatter everywhere. Here's a good guy. Oh, this dude, right on. Say hello. Oh, they nice love dream. to have their bellies scratched, oh, whereas okay. sharks are a little more finicky. Right. And they're like cats, I always say, and they love to run away. Right. These guys uh, can swim 45 miles per hour. Wow. So they can hunt a lot of prey. The, another thing about your toes, the big guys, they love to nibble on your toes. It's oh, really right? great. Okay. Oh, yeah. What animals don't have a brain, don't have any blood, and eat nothing but meat? It's not zombies. Believe it or not, it's jellyfish. At the new Planet Jellies expansion at Ripley's Aquarium, you're going to get to see thousands of them, some of which you're actually going to be able to put your hands on in the jellies touch pool. Now, these will be totally safe to touch, but you don't have to tell your friends that. Just let them think you were born with some kind of natural immunity to jellyfish things. And if you've got kids along, they're going to love the soft playground, which is going to give you a chance to kick back with something delicious from the concession stand. So it turns out that sharks are much pickier eaters than you'd think. The food they get here at the Ripley's Aquarium is restaurant grade, then cut into bite-sized pieces of marlin and squid, and we even sneak in a vitamin pill to keep them healthy. Then it's on to the tank where dinner is served. Believe it or not, there isn't a massive feeding frenzy like you'd expect. The Ripley sharks have great table manners. But I'm going to feed them with a pair of grandma grabbers just in case my hands look unintentionally delicious. I'm pretty attached to them. And hanging out below at a nice safe distance, some of the other fish waiting around for anything that accidentally gets dropped. Now, Ripley's Aquarium's newest exhibit is called Slime. Now, don't let a little snot news scare you off. It's part of everyday life for these creatures. Now, here, you're going to learn some new stuff about animals that you thought you knew everything about already. For instance, did you know the male American lobster actually pees on lady lobsters? It's part of the mating process, and they love it. I wouldn't try that at your house, though. Might be best just to stick with chocolate. So we did just about everything Ripley's Aquarium has to offer, and even some stuff that nobody gets to do. But remember, you can still come out this summer brand new. You can actually swim with the sharks. We'll see you next time on Tommy on the Town.